anywhere. We're Matt and Nat, a travel couple based out of Nashville, Tennessee. After having our world turned upside down in 2020, we decided to set out on our biggest adventure yet to see all 50 states in a year. In our last video, we were in Omaha, Nebraska, where we got wild at one of the best zoos in the world, ate the original Reuben sandwich at the place that it was invented, and checked off a bucket list item being in two places at once. This week, we're in the Mount Rushmore state. Welcome to South Dakota. Today we're in Sioux Falls, which is the state's largest city, and we are super excited to explore it with you. This is our very first time visiting South Dakota, and it's already making a great impression. <laughs> if you couldn't tell, we are staying in an amazing hotel. It's called Hotel on Phillips. It's right downtown, and we are honestly blown away mm. with it. One of the awesome things about it is that they have a local coffee shop called Coffee Roastery right here in the lobby, and it's the perfect way for us to get our day started. Let's actually put some clothes on first. That's probably a good idea. Let's go! Well, I'm standing where I would have been drinking my coffee had we not gotten here a little bit late. We didn't look up the hours and they currently have temporary hours. We travel during the week, as most of you know, so we deal with places being closed more often than not. So we're gonna have to call an audible. We don't know what that is yet, but we will let you know. <laughs> All right, so later this afternoon, we're gonna give you a full tour of this beautiful hotel. But right now, we're gonna go check out downtown Sioux Falls. So downtown has this really cool thing called the Sculpture Walk, which is a public art display that includes 60 sculptures and spans the entire downtown area. It changes every spring. So if you come year after year, you're gonna see new art. So as we explore downtown, we're gonna be hitting up some of these sculptures along the way. This sculpture right here is our favorite one yet <laughs> because the shadow is Mona Lisa. Yeah, it doesn't look like much on the front. No, but, but when you check yeah. out the shadow, that's awesome. That's pretty cool. Best in show winner of 2021 is right here. It is a awesome moose. I think his name is Maximus. Hold on, uh, his name is, yeah. So Maximus the Moose won best in show 2021. <laughs> So the State Theater here is playing one of my favorite movies of all time, Casablanca. I think I'd have to probably pay Matt a million dollars to watch it with me here, but that is exactly what I would do if it was just Adventures of Nat. <laughs> Wouldn't be very thrilling. Hey, I got a question for you. Uh, do you want to watch Casablanca with me, the movie at the State Theater? I don't even know what Casablanca is. Are you kidding me right now? It's one of the most classic I'll movies of all time. I'll watch The Sandlot with you. No, Casablanca. It's playing tonight. Is tonight? Yeah. Is Let's do it. You guys know I love my teas and they have a tea shop, so let's go. It was good. Very refreshing. I'm not used to having cold tea, but I think I could do it. can't take her anywhere. Huh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Don't mind me. <laughs> this isn't free entertainment. Actually, it is free entertainment. <laughs> I guess you're right. <laughs> you know what else is free? Hitting that thumbs up button down below and the subscribe button. <laughs> It's free and it really, really helps out our channel. If you guys don't know, we're headed to all 50 states this year and we have a lot more to go. So please make sure you guys hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on any of our uploads. You can also follow along on Instagram at Adventures of Matt and Nat for story highlights of every trip. Let me go dance now. <laughs> Am I pretty close? Perfect, it's beautiful. I miss my calling. This downtown is so cute. We are really enjoying it. But now it's time for food. I got it. I don't remember what it was called. 
So I got the hot mashed potato and fried chicken wrap, which is exactly what it sounds like. Hot mashed potatoes, cheese, tomatoes, a drizzle of ranch, and chicken tenders chopped up and put in a wrap. What's not below about that? Hand breaded chicken tenders, mashed potatoes, ranch, cheese, the winner in my book, with more potatoes on the side. Very American of you. <laughs> I think Matt's looks disgusting, <laughs> and I love mashed potatoes, but I don't know, mixed with all my other things, I don't know. And I got the hand breaded chicken tenders. They hand bread them here every day, and they look phenomenal. I also got the sweet potato fries. This is dollar upgrade, so we will see if it's worth it. Boom, I love sweet potato fries. Lunch was really good, but now we're headed to get some dessert. There is an excellent patisserie right here downtown Sioux Falls called CH Patisserie, and we've heard they have excellent macarons. The owner and pastry chef Chris actually won Top Chef Just Desserts Season 2, so let's check it out. We got six macarons. Yep. I picked three and Matt picked three. Yep, I got the cake frosting, salted caramel, and the strawberry cheesecake. And I got the flavor of the month, which is passion fruit, lemon, and puppy chow. Oh, so good. Which one are you gonna try first? So I think I'm gonna do salted caramel first. I'm gonna do puppy chow. The last time I've had a proper macaron. I was going <laughs> for it. Parisian macaron was in Paris. Paris. And we went to the place that it invented them. Yes, these look amazing. I think they're gonna be right on par with those. Can I go now? Yeah, <laughs> man. Mm. Got that crunch, gooey, perfect texture, perfect. That is a textbook macaron, exactly what it's supposed to be. I don't like salted caramel, so you, that you get the whole one to yourself. I should have got salted caramel, coffee one. What else do you not like? <laughs> we also got sweet peach tea, but mm -hmm. it's not sweet. Not for us southerners, you know? Southern, it's still good though. Southerners have a different standard of sweet tea. Yeah, try it. It ain't sweet. <laughs> I want to know what their unsweet tea was. We like the stuff that hits the back of your throat. And you go. And you get diabetes. <laughs> it's like instant diabetes. Like boom, diabetes. <laughs> I'm doing the cake frosting next. Mine wins most aesthetically pleasing. I mean, look at that. That's pretty. Oh, this one is so light and refreshing. The flavor. I mean, look at that crunch. That's good. This one's like a sugar overload. Was it? And it's great. This is very tart. It is, isn't it? I like it. <laughs> People are in here. <laughs> you guys have to come to this place. We haven't even finished our last two, but. Highly recommend. Cheers. Delicious though. Oh, and it's a really cute vibe here too. And they also have Parisian hot chocolate, but it's very hot here, so I'm not gonna get hot chocolate. They have other beautiful desserts here. Mm. Five thumbs up. Guys, we did it. We found <laughs> postcards. We want to thank everyone right here down below for supporting our channel and us. We couldn't do this without you. With your help, we're able to continue shooting videos like this and to continue improving this channel. If you guys are interested in checking out our Patreon, getting exclusive cool goodies <laughs> and content, check out the link in the description. So we've got a little bit of downtime before we have to be at our next activity, so we're gonna head back to the hotel and freshen up a little bit. And as promised, we're gonna give you a room tour. <laughs> bit 
about the hotel before we get into the room tour. This building was built in 1918 as the Sioux Falls National Bank and was the tallest building in South Dakota until 1941. Fast forward to 2018, 100 years after the original construction, and they began the renovation process to turn it into what it is today, Hotel on Phillips. Now let's get into the room tour. Welcome to my crib in Sioux Falls, South Dakota. We come into our hallway here with the beautiful windows. Here's our beautiful bathroom. Check it out. And then here's our bedroom with a nice little kitchenette. It also has an awesome Alexa. Play some jazz music. so obsessed with this hotel. You guys have to stay here when you come to Sioux Falls. So this is me like freshening up, right? Let's see what Matt's doing. Freshening up. Are you freshening I'm, up? I'm mentally freshening up. Oh, okay. It's for my mental health. Such a hard life. Mental health freshening up. We have to go, come on. <laughs> So we just finished freshening up, <laughs> and unfortunately our next adventure was canceled due to weather. Yeah, so we had originally planned to do an evening hot air balloon ride, How which epic. we were super excited about, but it's a little too windy today to do that, so we had to call a last minute audible. Thankfully, Natalie was able to find some pretty awesome plans for the night. We're gonna be headed to Straw Bale Winery. They're doing this series, it's the Summer Porch Series. There's live music, food trucks, should be pretty cool. So we've got our lawn chairs. We're about to go listen to some live music, enjoy some good wine and food. We did not bring these lawn chairs though because we didn't know we were doing this. So we were very grateful that Hotel on Phillips actually has these at the hotel and you're free to check them out if you're a hotel guest, which was awesome. I got the Oh My Berries, which is a blueberry wine with strawberry margarita mix. And I got the Black Ice, which is their black currant wine with lime margarita mix. Mm. This one's a lot more tart than yours. Yours is milder, but both are delicious. <laughs> So much fun it was super cute it's like a farm <laughs> there were cats and chickens and the wine was good and it was a super local experience i really do think we were probably the only people here tonight that weren't from this area which made it really special it really know, it did really cool y'all have to check it out if you're ever in sioux falls straw bale winery and now we're headed to out of this place whatever it is it's way better than that <laughs> absolutely i love this place yeah, it's beautiful and i see why everybody says if you come to sioux falls it is an absolute must to come to falls park now we're headed to another iconic spot This right here is the 
Park of Dreams, and it is an iconic sculpture here in Sioux Falls. So it spans almost an entire football field, 100 yards from end to end. And if you see up there, there's a little gap where it doesn't connect, and that is to represent the leap of faith that dreamers take to make their dreams come true. Oh, which I is pretty love cool. that. That's what this YouTube channel is. So <laughs> this is really cool. It really is. <laughs> amazing sunset at Ark of Dreams. We are headed to, you guessed it, dinner. <laughs> so we were walking down the street earlier today and we had a local that is very involved in the community tell us that we had to eat at this place called- Had to. Ma yes, had to <laughs> eat at this place called Minerva's. It's been open since 1977, right here downtown Sioux Falls and we're excited to try it out. We apologize in advance for the dim lighting in here. It's a fancy restaurant, you know how it goes. But I got the South Dakota bison ribeye, cooked medium rare, got fresh asparagus, and I got the cognac glazed wild mushrooms as an add-on to my steak. Let me cut into this steak and see how it is. I can already tell you it's nice and tender. Look at that. Here we go. Mm. That is very good. It is cooked perfect. Excellent char from the grill on it. Seasoned very simply, but very well. I have no complaints about that. So I ordered the pheasant risotto, and I have never had risotto before, or pheasant, I don't think. So I'm really excited though, because it sounded super fancy. So let's do it. Mm. kind of food that makes a good cross side? 1,000%. Because it did. Did it really? Yes. That is phenomenal. I'm obsessed. Okay, I gotta go because I'm gonna eat all of this. <laughs> that was phenomenal. Delicious. I wish I could remember the guy's name who told us to go there earlier today. MVP. I can't, but he's just proof that not all heroes wear capes. <laughs> We are now going to take a stroll down Main Street, which is actually Phillips Ave, back to our hotel because we are headed to one of the coolest bars in town. It's called The Treasury, and if you remember from earlier, I told you that our hotel was actually an old bank building. They kept the original vault and like the 16-ton door, and now that is the entrance to The Treasury Bar. <laughs> And just like that, our time here in Sioux Falls in South Dakota has come to an end. We didn't really have any expectations and they really surpassed them. It was yes. so much fun. We honestly cannot wait to come back to South Dakota to explore more. We hope you enjoyed watching this video. And if you did, we hope you'll hit that thumbs up button down below. And maybe you'll consider hitting that subscribe button as well because it helps our channel out so, so much. We'll see you guys next week in state number... 35? 35? Five. We'll see you guys then. <laughs> I don't want to give everybody a show, you know what I mean? Sweet. Or do I? No, I don't. No, I don't. <laughs> anyway. Pardon moi, escoutez moi. We even say that all the time as a joke. <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Who slept in here while we were gone? You freshening up, you remember? Oh, I was freshening up my mental health. <laughs> oh, your hair oh. went right at my nose. <laughs> We have everything. <laughs> Are you kidding me? You know, I'm half of mine. <laughs> okay, so I just saw a county courthouse and it said M I N N E H A H A. Wouldn't you call that Minahaha? -ha. <laughs>
house. No. Ha -ha. No. <laughs> Why do I think that's so funny? <laughs> Crack myself up. So please leave a comment below if you agree with me. If it's anything else, I don't want to hear it. Okay? Yeah. Don't ruin my parade. Is that the saying? Don't rain on oh. my parade. <laughs> don't rain on my which, parade. Which technically would, yes, ruin the parade. Yeah, so. ruin the parade. If you're raining on my parade, don't ruin it. So, thanks. <laughs> No, Casablanca. That sounds like a dance <laughs> to the Casablanca. Let's go. <laughs> Where do you see that at? <laughs>